Oh. So today is today, Thursday, technically. Um, good day. <laughs> 135 phone calls, dials done, and two scheduled demos. So it didn't have the same sort of rush as yesterday, like that competitive sort of thing, but still got 135 done. And what I'm actually starting to see is the benefits of actually doing the 100 plus dials per day because because two demos scheduled today puts me at 12 scheduled for the month, which puts me at tied for the account executive because I'm junior account executive, the account executives total demos booked in this month. I think it's like 12 is the first top and then the second is like 10. So it is just showing like I'm competing or ranking and performing. The results I am driving are in line with. So I'm continuing on the cell phone because I believe this, I just need, need to charge it. It's colder outside today. I don't like that I can see my face. Um, what was I saying? I don't even know when it turned off. Let's just start from the beginning and then just cut it out whenever. Okay, so I'm continuing on my phone because the GoPro died, so that sucks. But what I was saying is, I'm glad that I'm being reinforced for the idea that I adopted of just kind of like do see what the top per person is doing and do more than them, as well as there's that like 100 day, 100 day challenge, which is you like do 100 reach outs, 100 cold calls, 100 minutes of content for 100 days, and then you will see success. And then so just for that actually to be coming true is cool. Um, so that's fun. So 135 and two. Um, this morning I also slept in and slept in like I got up at like seven something um, instead of and didn't actually go for the walk, which I normally do, but not today. What else? Low energy today. I don't know if it's something in the air. I don't know what it is. But here's the thing that I did learn is the fact that there was the guy who I booked the demo for the second time. The second demo that I booked. The first time I called him was yesterday. And when I introduced myself, I came at it like high energy. I don't look like, like, uh, well, let's invent a name. Like, Hi, John, this is Duncan calling with Planswell. How have you been? Like super kind of like that. And his immediate response was, uh, I got to take another phone call and hung up. Like, so the phone call lasted 10 seconds. So when I re-listened to that recording, it was like, okay. And he had a really monotone voice. So this time I came in with a really muh, 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 kind of tone, like kind of like what I'm speaking in right now. Um, and like, it was more like a, like a, hi, John, this is Duncan with plans. Well, how have you been? And he stayed on the line and I stuck to that tone throughout. He didn't, he wasn't super cooperative, but yeah, it, was, it worked. But I guess that's the whole thing about whole, all in tonality where that comes from. And maybe the high energiness feels good, but it also might be, it might like, you might just immediately think, oh, this is a sales call. And generally, when people recognize that, they don't want to continue with it. Um, what else has happened? Oh, like I've so I've started uploading. I uploaded the fourth one today. What's crazy though is the first video has 17 views as of when I checked it on well today, like four hours ago, which is weird because I haven't promoted it at all or anything. So then just the fact that it's organically getting that is interesting. I wonder, my, my thought is perhaps, look, I think what's weird about it is more the, the, I haven't seen success like that. And I would call that success because there's no effort being put into it with the videos, like the personal growth collection things. Like 17 views would be like, oh yeah, you got that. Like there's some videos that would have more than that over a six month time frame. Like going like, okay, well, traffic kind of comes and it sometimes shows up but fuck my arm's tired um but like 
it's, it's interesting. I, I'm curious if the YouTube algorithm or the way that it's set up instead of like putting on the front page, just like people you're subscribed to, but put people, like it puts different videos and stuff. Maybe it's different, I have no idea. But what's nice about it, it is, it, it, is, it is encouraging and makes me incentivized to keep going. So, good call on YouTube, I gotta switch arms. Oh, but fuck the cameras. Um, either things that are happening. Oh, I don't like that I can see my face because I keep just looking at myself, even though I have to look there. What else? Um, I'm going to try to get up tomorrow and actually come for the walk. That's a habit I want to get into. Um, this one's pretty, I don't have much to say. I think more of the things that I'm thinking right now are, I don't understand how there's 17 views. The fact that there's 17 views makes me want to continue doing it and also makes me want to put effort into it and then makes the idea of actually starting a separate channel, specifically the ideas or tools one, um, more like that seems like something I actually might want to do or like, like is worth pursuing. But yeah, like I, that's, that's all there is today. I think, I think mostly what, where my, why I'm so surprised with the 17 is because I had calibrated my emotions and thought to assume I was going to get zero views for like three years. And they're like going like, you're not going to see any sign of success. So then the fact that it's at 17 is like, whoa, again, not a lot. And they're probably not watching a significant portion of it. Like it's not turning into anything, but just the fact that it's already there. It's like, okay. So yeah, I've just repeated myself this entire time, <laughs> but <laughs> I will see you later.